Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. So for today's food preserving project, I am going to be trying my hand at dehydrating eggs. I went back to my farmer's market and I picked up some unwashed eggs. So I'm going to dehydrate the ones that weren't clean enough for water glassing and I am going to try my hand at dehydrating. So this is the ones, some of the ones I have. I have a couple of other cartons in the fridge and I'm going to try this first with my silicone liners for my dehydrator that I got from Amazon and I'm liking them pretty good. Some things I don't like about them but otherwise than that they're pretty good. Um, I am going to beat them and pour them onto the trays and get to dehydrating and see how I get along. So if this is going to be good for me, I am going to pretty much um, do the rest of them this way because I do have, I think, about four gallons in total of water glass eggs. And just looking at them here, I probably should have put them through the blender instead of mixing them by hand, beating them by hand. But we'll see how this comes out. So I did a whole dozen eggs and I put them on three trays and I probably could have fit them on two trays. So maybe next time I'll do two dozen and do the whole four trays at one time. So we'll see how this comes out. I'm going to keep my fingers crossed and hopefully it will come out good. So this is the result of 12 eggs, a dozen eggs dehydrated. It went really well for the first time so this is three dozen eggs once powdered it's about a cup um, per uh, 12 or a dozen eggs so I am actually going to test it out and see how it tastes once I rehydrate it and I'm just gonna um, scramble it just like I would normally do and see how it tastes to see if I can see the difference I will say um, it's a lot more orangey yellow than I had expected, but these are farm fresh eggs, so I guess um, because the yolk is a lot darker than a store bought. So here I have a quarter cup of the mix, and it does look very granulated. So we'll see how this goes. And I'm actually going to put in uh, about a quarter of a cup of liquid, and we're going to mix this up and. It actually is reminding me of um, sort of cornmeal, sort of uh, cream of wheat or cream of, um, what is that called? That cereal, that uh, cream of wheat cereal, if you ever made that. That's what it kind of looks like. Um, I'm not sure if you can see this on camera, but it kind of looks very grainy. So I'm going to let this sit for about 10 minutes to rehydrate. So I did add in uh, another about a eighth of a cup of water, so in total, um, and it is still grainy. And I almost want to add the rest of this quarter cup, but I don't think I should. That would be a whole half a cup into a quarter cup of eggs. So let's mix it up and see how it goes. I will say, again, it still looks grainy. It smells good, um, but the graininess I don't know if it's picking it up on camera or not so they do taste like eggs but they are a bit grainy and I think that's because I used a coffee grinder to um, actually grind the eggs I did put the rest in the blender and it did sort of make them a bit more fluffier than they were before so I think if you have like a high speed like a Vitamix or something like that it would be better so that's my every bit counts challenge and I will be doing these dehydrated eggs again. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified when I upload videos. Thank you very much and have a great day.